Hello and welcome back to Parkour Training Facility. Uh, I believe I said I was going to start with ladder jump eight, so let's get on with it. Wow, that is a big jump. Might have to sprint this one. I think I will I have to jump from a bit further back. No, it's going to need to do it. Like. Ooh, that's close. So yeah, this is going to be... Ooh. That is difficult, that. Like I say, this is going to be pretty much... This is the hardest um, section of the map. Can I actually make it from here, I wonder? That doesn't actually look possible, though. I think I'm literally going to have to sprint it. I think that's the only way it's possible. It's definitely going to be possible. Yeah. All right, let's try. I'm going to have to jump from a little bit further back. Hmm. There we go. So I made it that time. Let's try on this side. And then we'll need to do some kind of correctional stuff to make it. All right, so we're going to say, I'll say two more attempts on this. But yeah. There we go. Perfect. So, what are we doing? Eight. Nine. Wow. Wow, this one is going to be tricky. Yeah, it's going to be very, very tricky, this one. Yeah, I'm not even making it even when I... Even when I'm not making the first ladder. I'm certainly not going to make it just by jumping off the ladder. I need to get right on that corner spot. Right on the ledge, right there. So maybe if I... Yeah. Maybe if I just do something like this. I think that I think I literally I just have to go straight forward on it. I think that must be the way to do it. Yeah, I think so. To get the as long as I get the as long as I get the jumping time right, should be should be fine actually. Let's see if we can get this. Okay. No, not quite. All right, I'm going to say three more attempts. There we go. Made it. All right, so we've got two more attempts for this one. Ooh. Possibly did make it that one time. Didn't make it that time. But yeah. So the best way to do these very long ones like that are oh, clearly just to, just to go literally for the straight line approach. Um, and like I've mentioned, yeah, there is nothing there. But around the other corner, right in that corner, there's a couple of jumps as well. Um, so yeah, I might try these and then, yeah. So ladder side jump one. Is that the yeah, I mean, that's as far as that can can go, you'd think. Let us side jump one. So we go in here, right? Yep. Not really seeing the difficulty there. Yes, yeah, it's, it's actually hard, pretty hard to miss that since. But anyway, so that's, well, that's that one, I guess. Um, no, the side jump two. Okay, so I can imagine. Oh, 
Really? What's the difference? So that was one block above. To me, that look. Well, either way, they're both pretty easy. And they're both complete. So that's that section done. So let's, um, so we've got obstacle ladder jumps here, obstacle ladder jump, S jump one, S jump two, S jump three. Hmm. So there seems to be a bit of a, a multitude of stuff here. I wanted to go around this corner though, because obviously this is the stuff I was doing last time. Um, so ladder, corner jump counterclockwise, um, clockwise. This is going to be a little bit more tricky, I think. This is going to be much more tricky. This, this, this is a tricky jump. No, I made it though. Let's try and stick on. Might, I might even review this footage. Yeah, that was that was good. Mm. Definitely made it that time. Perfect. Okay. Let it jump counterclockwise. Okay. Now this one, yeah, I think this is actually a bit harder. Wow, yeah, this so this is this is this is definitely harder. I'm not going anywhere near this time. Hmm. Let me just do this one again. Yeah, I don't want to be too forceful with it. Yeah, I thought so. It's got to be quite a light touch, actually. Hmm. I'll try two more attempts. I'm kind of I'm, I'm happy that at least I've got something on it. Ah. All right. So I think in time I'm going to do better than that. Oh, there's actually jumps here as well. Ladder climb. Well, I'm here now, so let's try. And these two seem to be again sort of unique things here. Ladder climb. So go up here. Yeah, but you can't actually jump there because that is like a solid block. Hmm. So we're going to go around here. And again, let's try the same thing. Good. 
All right. So there's the first one done. Now again, we sort of it's a similar sort of thing to the um, yeah. It's good to do it like this anyway. All right. There we go. So we just sort of aim out a little bit and then try and keep it very light. Hmm. Really is about clockwise rotation, even though. Wow. It's interesting this actually. Seems I'm better on one side than the other, but I guess it's not that much of a surprise. How was I getting it this time then? Hmm. All right, I'm gonna try two more times here. All right, last one. All right, follow that one then. Damn. All right. Okay. So we haven't got that many left really, these obstacle jumps here, obstacle ladder, wait, it's obstacle ladder jump, obstacle ladder jump, and then we have these S jumps, corner jumps, I've been doing corner jumps a while, so let's try this one. Hmm, I think I may have jumped onto it. There we go. Ooh. Mm. Not quite. Perfect. Okay. All right. So corner jump 11 plus obstacle. I seem to be getting the timing of it better anyway. Yeah, and I think when you feel confident you're not going to hit your head with the thing, it makes it very similar to the last jump. Ooh. I think I could probably do the right one more easily. I don't know why. Yeah, I thought so. Hmm. All right, three more attempts, I think, for this one. 
That wasn't bad. Penultimate. And final attempt. Ooh. I'll give it one more just because I was quite close that time. Not that one, though. Alright, so she get a jump off. Hmm. Alright, well, that one's done, I guess. Well, kind of. Um, so what do we do then? We did these ladder jumps at the end there. Um, we haven't done the S jumps. Um, I wanted to do these obstacle jumps as well. All right, obstacle jump eight. Oh, wow. No, actually, it's exactly the same thing, isn't it, really? Because you're not going to hit your head on there anyway. Yeah, you really have to get absolutely perfect trajectory. Yeah, it's actually probably even it's probably actually slightly more helpful to have it like this because you know that if you can if you're hitting the thing then you're not making it properly. But then again, I don't see how you can actually land on the far edge. That doesn't make much sense. How can you land on the far edge? So you come in like that, and then you land there. I suppose you can actually. Need to jump real early there. Let's try the other side. No, because you're not going to make it if I know if you do that. Ooh, I felt a little better. Unless there's a possibility. I wonder actually if you could actually. So let's go up here. I wonder if I can actually engage sprint. No, I don't think you can. I think it is literally impossible to engage sprint at this stage. I think you literally have to be already sprinting, and that's the only way you're going to make it. Either way, though, it's still tricky. Ooh, I felt like I was very, very close that time. Hmm. All right, I'm going to say three more goes on this then. Let's just do one last thing. I wonder, oh, maybe I just do it like this. Yeah, that was, so I'm trying, to, I'm just remembering now that I actually just went in a straight line. That's actually the way you do it. All right. I'm actually going to try a bit more than this then. If you just go in a straight line, it's the only way you can do it. I think maybe you have to land on the near edge and then you sprint across the ladder. Yeah, I think that is the way. So you land on the near edge, sprint a bit, jump again while maintaining sprint. I'm not landing on the top of the ladder, that's the problem.
did land on top there though. Hmm. Well, <sighs> felt closer. No, I literally, as soon as I engage sprint here, I need to be jumping. Oh, I made it. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to say two more attempts on this. All right, so it's literally sprint from four blocks back. And then jump across. All right. Now. <laughs> Yeah, I thought this might be the case. All right. I'm gonna have to review, I'm gonna have to review that footage as well. I don't even know how I managed to make that one. This one, I imagine, if I did exactly the same thing, I'd, I'd make it exactly the same way. But it's a very tough jump. All right, so I think we're gonna say, hmm. Yeah, three more from this point out. I'll say three more on each side from this point. So I give it a real go. Penultimate. Didn't even get to the edge of the thing there. Penultimate. Final. secondary jump. I've got absolutely flying there. Final now. Alright, so that one's very, very difficult, but I think um I think if I use the same tennis as before. To get at least I got one on the board for the last one. You got you gotta look at it that way. Um and yeah I've done everything so it's S jumps. And this is the first S jump. Oh, I see what they mean now. Did I make that? I'm not sure I did. Definitely did that time there. No, that is not an S jump. I think, I think, yeah. Yeah, the S jump is like... Wow, <laughs> that's an interesting jumping style. Let's try and get this S. I like this jump. It feels quite like a very natural sort of jump now. And of course, oh no, but this is a very important jump to do, right? In fact, this sort of jump unlocks a lot of other types of jumps. Probably not those jumps, those ladder ones I was just doing. But a lot of the corner jumps look much easier like this. Ooh, that's close. Ooh. 
Ooh, yeah. That one worked out very nicely. And again. And again. Wow. Luck and the S jumps. <laughs> this is where it gets really tough there. To do an S jump and ascend. Made it. And again. Wow. I might have found my niche. But there is one S jump to go. And it's the hardest one. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> now this one is fucking hard. I may struggle with this one. Oh, it's hard to get the rotation at the end. Yeah, it's very hard to get the rotation at the end because you're trying to do so much in terms of forward motion. It really requires a... Yeah, this one. But still, it's good though, because at least I can know what my actual current sort of ability level is. I'm not getting the full of my rotation really. Even if I actually try to just jump straight to it, it'd probably be a bit of a bit of a difficult anyway. No, I'd probably make it a bit more easily, but still. Alright. Three more on either side. Three more for the left now. An ultimate for the left. So yeah. <clears throat> All right. Oh my gosh! Only just gone and fucking made it. Wow. All right. So that is. Wow. Well, I'm happy. I'm happy with that. You know. I'm happy with that. Even on this impossible one here, I did actually manage to get one of them. Um, didn't get any there, but all the others I managed to do. I mean, in all, I think I've done, you know, it's been pretty good so far. Um, obviously, I knew this map was going to be a test, and it's going to get, you know, it's going to get higher from here on out. But I feel it's gone pretty well. And I also feel that, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with what's gone in this map. I think there's probably, probably about two or three jumps over the whole map that I haven't actually been able to make at all. Everything else I've made at least once. Um, and yeah, and I've made I've made some pretty hard jumps along the way as well. So until, so that's the end of this series, yeah. So thanks for watching.